just wanted to make a quick video because I am working on a custom prayer journal and um, I wanted to decoupage some glassine bags. I wanted to decoupage two glassine bags and I don't have napkins and I know that um, you know a lot of people have those pretty napkins and what have you and I can't find them and whenever you find them they are like super expensive so I seen a video I don't know X amount of months ago I can't even remember where because I just surf YouTube when I can't sleep and you know if if it was your video please you know comment below I, I just watch so many videos I can't I can't keep track of them all but it was on taking regular uh, paper towels and for this one I use Bounty not the Selecta size I don't use the Selecta size I used Bounty which is the regular you know sheets and freezer paper not wax paper it's freezer paper plastic coated and I got this uh, at I got this at ShopRite. Uh, I know Walmart has it as well. But it has to be freezer paper, plastic coated. So what I did was I cut off a, you know, a sheet of my bounty. And the freezer paper has two sides. As you can see, one is shiny and the other one is opaque. Well, you put your napkin on the shiny side okay and you lay it on it and then you grab your iron and you iron it right you iron it so that it sticks to your uh, freezer paper and you want it to be uh, nice and stuck because especially around the edges because you're gonna run this through your printer so however you feed your printer, uh, my printer feeds this way to print on this side, all right? So after you, you have stuck your freezer paper, your napkin to your freezer paper, you, like what I do is I just grab a regular size cardstock and you wanna cut it, you know, to the normal size that your printer takes. So then I just cut my napkin with the freezer paper still attached to the size that my printer takes. So now you have, you know, say for example, this is your napkin with your freezer paper. You take it to your printer and then you just pick your image and you print your image onto your napkin. And what it leaves you is with something like this. So this is your napkin. Okay, and then you just peel it off. Okay, I'm not gonna try to do it because I need two hands and I'm holding my phone. But this is gonna be your, your pretty napkin. And now this will be ready for you to decoupage onto whatever it is that you wanna decoupage. See, pretty neat, huh? So, if you guys wanna a full tutorial on it uh, let me know but I think it's pretty much self-explanatory I hope I did good on explaining it but isn't that pretty and that way you can print out whatever image you are looking for anyway I hope that helps uh, if you have any questions let me know let me go because I I'm about to finish this journal all right guys bye